Breaking news this afternoon. After 45 years, a suspected serial killer is finally in a local courtroom today, charged with his second murder. Dan Tilkin was in the Clark County courtroom and asked Warren Forrest if he has anything to say to the families of these seven women he's suspected of killing. Dan? And detectives say Warren Forrest still has so many secrets. As the guards escorted him past me, he kept quiet. Warren, do you have anything to say to the families? The last time Warren Forrest in the orange jumpsuit was in the Clark County Courthouse, it was 40 years ago. He'd been convicted of the 1974 killing of Krista Blake. It's the only murder charge he had ever faced until now. Through an unexpected DNA breakthrough, detectives can now link Forrest to the killing of Portland teenager Martha Morrison, also in 1974. Detectives think he killed seven women and teenagers. One of those was 14-year-old Diane Gilchrist, who is still missing. And this morning, I spoke to her sister. What do you want for your sister? Um, justice. Yeah, justice. Yep. <laughs> Him to be hung. <laughs> Wait, you should be uh, doing as a child predator too. How come you ain't being charged with that? Martha Morrison's body was identified after her blood was found on a weapon Forrest admitted using to attack a woman who survived. She wasn't in the courtroom today, but the woman who was 15 when Forrest abducted her was there today to see Forrest in shackles. So Forrest will be back in court next week, but it could be more than a year before he stands trial, as his lawyers can will probably try to pick apart the evidence which is now 45 years old.